Hello, welcome back to the Project Hercules Diaries. The gate is all but done. You can see the notches in there. And now the gear selector goes into first and it's held in place there so it won't pop out of gear unless there's a, a force applied manually by a man, i.e. me. Um, second gear there and then it drops back into the notch and then back to neutral there. And what's holding that in, you can just see underneath there is the spring so as it goes into first gear the spring pulls it into the notch as it goes into second gear the spring pulls it into the notch and the spring holds it there in neutral so at the moment on the back of the spring if i just drop over the top you can see it's just wound in temporarily and by turning a few more turns on there we can adjust the spring tension there might be uh, a little bit more depth required in these because although it doesn't jump out again, it takes quite, quite a bit of force there. Um, if we tweak around with the, the spring tension, uh, we might just lengthen those notches. So there's absolutely no danger of it dropping out of gear. I think the chance of it dropping out of neutral is minimal. Certainly won't drop out of first because it's already trying to fall forwards. If you look at the angle there, it's just slightly on the lean and there's quite a bit of weight in the head it's more likely to drop out of second and what you don't want is to be powering through a bend at i don't know 130 or something um with the back end just skidding and all of a sudden with it cranked over at you know 47 degrees and all of a sudden it drops out of gear because that would make it a little bit too exciting in the wet wouldn't it boys right so that's where we're at at the moment um in other news massive amount of comments about the um the manifold i think the world would like to see it face forwards um i'm kind of down with that although when it does face forwards it slopes slopes slightly down if i can't get it to be completely horizontal it's probably going to end up sideways the new bell mouth has arrived but even where with that shorter bell mouth on the old one came to about there it's still too long to get my knees on i could make a new one of these and shorten it a bit but um at the moment, I'm thinking of sideways, but that's secondary. Uh, that's absolutely secondary because I know it runs like that and you can make everything fit. So that's where we're at. It's Friday night. It's definitely drink o'clock, but I'm very, very pleased with where we're at with the gate. Um, last few jobs will be to stamp on here a one, an N and a two for first, neutral and second, or maybe a, like on the lawnmowers, a tortoise and a hare. Uh, and I don't know, something zero in the middle, a uh, stationary object symbol. All of that's got to be thought about, but that's only just polish. Uh, and similarly, I want to cut the middle out of here just to, to lighten that up a bit. So that's where we're at at the moment. It's Friday night. It's definitely uh, beer o'clock, so I'm going to call it there. As usual, thank you for watching. More updates will follow.